I have a feeling that's too small to be a car. Traxxas X Max, and what we're gonna do is make it wider. So out to here, maybe. Now I got black because I have multiple bodies, different colors. And otherwise than that, I probably would have got the orange because I think the orange looks pretty good with this body in particular. It makes it look like a real beast. I'm gonna throw that on there. Keep an eye on the channel, and we'll see her ripping and flipping in no time. I'm also gonna probably throw the sledgehammer tires on there after I give this a run with the wide max at least once. Yeah, he got some really exquisite tires in today. They're beautiful. I mean, look at those. Just talking about this. These are the spare track stackers. I've been looking at it for a while. The knobs on it. It's super grippy. I imagine rippage isn't very good as far as unless it's on the surface. They're heavy, so flippage is going to be great. Uh, grippage and flippage. That's what you're going to get from these. And, uh,. Try those 17 millimeter hex, so like 1 8 scale. This is called the Q901, and then this is a Q902, and then they have a Q903. Keep an eye out for that, that'll be coming soon. I don't think anybody's gonna guess this one. Maybe Teresa, but I don't know. First of all, we have Andrew. How you doing, Andrew? Pretty good. Alright, my daughter Kat, how you doing? Oh, good. Okay. My wife Teresa. Doing well. Beastie Rob. Hello, everybody. What's in the box, guys? Maybe something similar to these, maybe a little bit bigger. It is similar, I would imagine. So you're saying similar, bigger. What are you saying, Andrew? Um, similar. Just similar? Yeah. Okay, what you got? I don't have any clue. I should, but I don't. Okay, what about you, then, Rob? Um, I'm going to go with Andrew and go with something similar. Okay, well, those answers are probably going to be correct because it's just general, but we can let that fly. But I am excited. Now, this particular car, I just want to say that is one of my favorites. I've actually bought it a couple of times. It crapped out on me once, uh, but I do things with it, too. I, I can't remember. I feel like it was my fault like one time, and then another one crapped out on me, and maybe I just didn't know what I was doing, but I, I happen to really like this particular car. I like the way it drove, I like the, it was very fun, and if anything I think it would flip, it's, a, it's a, kind of a smaller scale than these cars with heavier tires. So that means a little more flippage with the same power, it's 2S power, but powerful, what is it, 540 engine. So it's the Hoseam, not legendary, the Hoseam, oh wow, as I said the legendary only makes 3, 60 amp, Metal drive cups, comes with a heat sink, so that's cool. I don't recall that in the video. So they might have souped it up a little. Anyways, let's take a look. At least it's four wheel drive. It is four wheel drive. Very fun car to drive. Now these aren't going to do like, you know, 20 feet jumps or anything. They're fun to drive. Even a kid, you be careful with them. Not exactly cheap. This one is a little over $100. I like the looks of it. It's got thicker wheels, so with a shorter chassis. So we're looking at more wheelies, flips, more control. This thing here will jump about four feet, the Zingli Pong 9125 over here. The legendary, I feel, does about the same. I still have more fun with the Zingli Pong over here. And this is similar to that, except for its differences, which we're going to go through in a minute. So it's got a typical post scene remote. Except they changed the sticker. I haven't bought one of these cars in so long. As you can see, here's the old version of your whole seat. Here's your sticker. And then there's the new sticker. So that's pretty decent. Oh, it seems like a durable car. It seems like I have problems with electronics now. Maybe the wheels are too big and I just don't realize it, but I doubt it. Even uh, putting the metal skid plates on it. But I think they souped it up a little bit. They did. Look at the body. Oh, look at that. It just bounces. It doesn't even really bottom out. Oil fill shocks. Uh, 
tires look a little lighter than what I remember from my other ones, but they're still going to do great. So again, if you look at these, these jump, these are maybe flip if you use the hill. I mean flooring it off the hill. Um, so as you can see, these wheel bases are a little stronger. These are 110 scale. The wheels are these, smaller. Yeah, these are a little further out. So the chassis is a little longer, but the wheels are a little thicker and a little heavier. Maybe not as tall, but this car is very fun to drive. I wanted to show you guys that, and uh, hope you enjoyed the video. You guys have a good night.